This is Twit. Uh, let's go to, um, well, he used to be Fast Eddie, but he told me he's now Slow Eddie. Slow Eddie. In Detroit. In he's, Detroit. Detroit. He must have bought one of those Intel PCs. <laughs> I don't know. Hello, Slow Eddie. Leo Laporte, the tech guy. Thank you, Kim. Leo, Leo, Leo. I love your show. Thank you, sir. And I love Kim. Isn't she great? She needs her own show or a big portion of yours. I know. We should be. You know, I'm thinking about bringing in some more voices. We turn this into the tech guy zoo, and have Ooh. yeah. I, th I think we should have some more voices, and then I'll bring I'll get a right. you know a bell and a horn and a. <laughs> we can make uh, let's let's not go to uh, bulldog to... on the old Fraser Crane show. Yeah, kind of like that exactly. No, no. that's that's it's old school. Let me though. tell you. Hey, what can I do for you, slow? Why are you slow all of a sudden? Because I'm old. Oh, yeah, well. I used to be fast, Eddie, but, you know. Now you're slow. I can't run fast anymore, so. <laughs> if Kim was chasing me, I'd have to, I'd have to let her catch me. In know? your dreams, my friend. <laughs> what, what can I, what, what, can, picture. what can I do? <laughs> what can I do for you? <laughs> I have an old iPad mini that was, Oh, wow. transferred to me by a friend through Apple and all that stuff, legally mine. Yep. And <clears throat> since I've had the thing, uh, apparently uh, there was an email that I lost track of set up as my Apple password. But when you log in, you just have to use your regular password. And and it says Apple password, and it gives you an option for later. And I always, I've never put the... Because you don't know what it is, so you just right. say, yeah, later, man. Well, for years, you know, maybe three or four years, maybe. Yeah. I don't know. And uh, gone to the Apple store, called Apple and everything else, and they said, you're screwed without the password, without the, you know, and we can't help you. You have to and go to I, I, I forgot. I go to hell, you know. Go to iforgot.apple.com. This is... So Apple's a little bit of a dictatorship, I have to say. A little bit? <laughs> and it's uh, very much Apple's way or the highway. The reason they started doing this I is like to, prevent, to prevent to uh, prevent theft, <laughs> right? So yeah. um, uh, if somebody – and like if you'd stolen that mini or your friend forgot to release it, you wouldn't have been able to activate it. But, you know, it really is the – In my name, so it's – but they say it doesn't make any difference. No, no, you you have a password. They just don't know it. They can't tell you what it is. So you made the password, obviously, right? At some well, no, point. no, it was the, the 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 password that I have to get into it. Every don't day. yeah. So this is very common confusion. There's a login or a six digit code or four digit code. That's not what I'm. What that's they're, the one I use. Yeah. yeah, that's unlocks it. But you also have an Apple account. By the way, this is true of Windows as well. You have a Microsoft account in that case. But you have an Apple account. And Apple, in order to prevent theft, has now made your device very much tied to that Apple account. So you've been able to say later, because you don't need any of the features, has it stopped uh, letting you use it? I mean, has something gone wrong? Yeah, it just locked up and it says, you know, I have to enter my yeah. Apple password. You can't say later forever, I guess. No. Well, so this just really underscores the fact that you don't actually, long. you don't own that iPad. They own it. <laughs> Isn't that annoying? What? Yeah, well, you do own it. No, you, of course you own it. So if you forget your Apple login... Possession, but that doesn't mean anything. Yeah, possession zero-tenths of the law when it comes to electronics, I guess. So go to the website, and you can do it on another computer. I forgot. I like just the... Yeah, I like, I forgot. I forgot. Well, dot Apple dot com. Trying to find something to write on here. Hang, just bear with me a second. See if you can remember this. I forgot dot Apple dot com, and then you'll need to enter in your Apple ID. I just the letter I. Forgot. I forgot what dot Apple dot com. I forgot dot Apple dot com. It's a website that Apple set up for people who forgot their password. It is. It is. It's. It is a little annoying. Microsoft's moved in this direction too. And Windows 11 will require you to set up a Microsoft account to use it. And I don't like it, but Apple and Microsoft get to decide, don't they? Leo Laporte, the tech guy.